What's up guys, welcome back to my channel where we talk about all things volleyball. All right guys, last night we had a game. We had a game, we had a game. Wow, did we have a game. We played away in Scrab El Katav, one of the best teams in the league, and we were losing 2-0. Things not looking great. Things not looking good at all. But, boom, boom, boom. We came back to win. 3-2, five set victory for us. Amazing to get that win last night. It was really one of those matches that was not pretty at all. Both teams were just serving the crap out of the ball and a lot of high balls, a lot of block touches, a lot of defense, a lot of scrappiness. But in the end, I am just so proud of how we fought. We battled back from two sets down and won that fifth set 15-12. So, woof, amazing to stay undefeated in the Plus Liga. <laughs> Okay guys, we're gonna take it back a couple of months to the South American Men's Continental Championship. Like I talked about a little bit on this channel before, each zone in the volleyball world had a championship after Tokyo 20. So we're gonna watch the championship between Brazil and Argentina, a classic, classic rivalry in South America, and a rematch of the Tokyo 2020 bronze medal match won by Argentina. So we're gonna pick this match up in the fourth set, Brazil leading nine to seven, and we're gonna see how this match goes. Let's get into it. Okay, Brazil up nine seven, Argentina serving. Lucere, one of the top middles from the Olympics serving. Great serve, great pass, 10 foot line. Monster block, let's see this move by the middle. So Ramos here, number 18, gets over there, gets over. See how his arms are so over the net, even though he didn't close that seam, his arms are over the net, taking that sharp cross. That is what you call a monster block. Eight serving, nine. Lucere serving again. Jump serve, he can float it. Miss it in the net. 10 serving, eight. Flavio serving, good float serve. Whoa, how did he save that? Nice tool off the block. Let's watch this rotation. So Palacios here, number 13, thinks it's going out. The other outside covers his back. That is insane. That is such a sick pass. Also, who is number 25 serving right now for Argentina? I'm not sure who that is. 25 serving. Okay, got a jump serve. Allen again. Three men up and they didn't close the line. I wonder if that was strategy. Let's watch this again. So Argentina gets them out of system. Tough set here by Bruno. Allen spiking. Three man block a little bit messy there. Kind of. They left the line open as you can see. Maybe it's strategy because Danani, the libero for Argentina is such a good libero. But in general on three man blocks, you wanna close this line. You can see Alan sees that and rips it and it's so difficult to dig. Bruno, is he gonna jump or float? Went with the float. Jack that back. Nice touch, run it. Just setting Allen every ball here. Nice up. Argentina and their defense. Brazil and their block. Let's watch that block again. So here's a triple block again. Somehow they read this. A little bit cleaner than the last Argentina one we watched. Allen gets over. He's playing in Russia now. Blocks that straight down. Bruno again, going with this float. Trying to get Palacios out of system. Nice pass. Lima. Was Lima the top scorer in Tokyo, you guys? Cause he went off. He played so well, crushed us. We're not talking about it, but Argentina just playing so well. 10 serving 12, Palacios here. Good jump serve. A lot of power normally. <laughs> he went for that down the line and just missed it. Lucarelli coming from extreme one. Danani with the dime, Danani with the dime. And the high flat for Ramos. Let's watch this pass again. Let's pause on contact. I mean, what is there to say? It's picture perfect. Feet are good, he looks balanced, he's moving to his right. Shoulders are down, left shoulders dropped, platform is out. Just chef's kiss. Okay, 11, 13, Ramos with a sneaky jump serve. Short, Bruno, nice. Oh, dang it. Allen going off. 
Love this by Bruno. Ready, setters. Trying to set up Lucarelli here. He goes for the set. Allen, right in the seam. Just crushes it. Great play by Bruno to be ready off the net. Setters, you always got to be ready off the net. Lucas, 14-11. Oh, nice pass. Cover, go. Almost. You could see Argentina shifted on this pass because Lucas tends to serve to the middle, but he can't. So they brought four people in. You can see Lima, that's his name, gosh. Right on the line there, gets this ball. And then Brazil with the block. That's a big block. It's a big block. Lucas again, where's he gonna go? Goes to the line. Not as much to the line, so Donani had a better chance. Great cover. What? That is a monster block. Watch Alan's hand right here. Looks like he's gonna go inside, fakes inside, reaches out. Look at that right hand. Gets the line. <laughs> I wish I could do anything like that. Ugh. What a block. Lucas on a little run here, 16-11. Is he gonna go after that line again? Went for the seam, but missed it in the net. He wants that one back, because Lucas does not like to end his runs on a mistake. Lima, 12-16. Kept it in play, great pass. Okay, just, I'm gonna throw this. Just, can we just watch this pass? Bam, perfect technique, gets on the pipe. And then Flavio, just look how high he is. Hits it straight down, there's no chance, no chance. Allen, 17, 12, he likes to go down this line. Yep, off that tape, way to stay balanced. Great play there, tool off the block with the tip. Let's watch his pass. So the ball hits the net here. How do I go slow-mo? He wants to go down to his knees, you can see that, but he stays up. Leg strength, balance, kept his body up to pass that ball. And then the tool, great play. 13, 17. Can you guys hear the church bells in the back? Great pass. I mean, one on one, Allen's gonna win that most of the time, and he loves to hit that line. Let's see, just so much line for him to hit. He's gonna crush it. He's so good. Okay, viewers, what is this guy's name? I don't know his name. I know he's a young, up and coming Brazilian player. Argentina killing them with tips. Wow, I never noticed how far Danani comes into the court. Look how shallow he is. I wonder if that's strategy or if that's his personal technique, his personal thing going on, but he's super shallow there and makes the perfect pass. And then, ah, Brazil, you gotta get on that tip. Lucera again, float or jump, looks like a jump. Yeah. Just out. Flavio with this float, 1914. Great hand pass, a little bit off the net, but it's okay. Argentina and their middles and their middles. They just have a very unique ability to see the block and use it and carve around it and just get a kill. Just get kills. But at this point, down 15, 19, down two to one, they probably have to go for their serves. Let's see if the setter goes after it. Keeps it in. Great up. And then Lucas, how long has Lucas been playing and how long has he been crushing the ball like this? Let's look at this serve again. I think he wants this one back. It's not really short, it's not long, it has a lot of spin. Lucarelli is gonna nail that ball pretty much every time. And if you give Brazil opportunities like that, they're probably gonna put it away. Bruno again, 2015, flow. Yep, going with the float, always at Palacios. Great pass. What, what? Are you kidding? What? That was an insane play. First of all, this nice pass and then this defense. Look, basically no block up and Bruno just protecting himself, to be honest, protecting a certain area, gets that dig and then Lucas with the monster block. I'm speechless, I don't know. Out of the timeout, 21-15. Oh, Bruno goes with the spin, trying to catch him off guard. Just a little. Gosh, Brazil is touching everything. <sighs> Miscommunication. 
little bit tight there, it's okay. And then Lima, Lima, Lima puts it away. Let's watch this play again. So Bruno's trying to be sneaky here. He's gone with the float a couple of times. So he goes with a jump, trying to catch them off guard, goes deep, 10 foot pass, nice ball. Lucas, just touching everything. And then that one, I'm not sure what happened. And then a little bit out of sorts here, but then Lima just hits it. Oh, seven foot line, are you serious? Okay, 1621. I don't know who this is serving either. A lot of different players in this match, but he went for it. You gotta go for it, but he just missed it long. Lucarelli, 2216, closing in. Great fight, great fight. Trying to tip. Oh, he saw that block up. He saw that block and I think he just tried to avoid it. I can't, look how shallow Danani is. I don't understand. And then fights that off. They gotta hit the ball. He'll hit it, but he just went for the hands. Missed it by a little bit. 23-16, Lucarelli again. Fights it off to the 10, 11 foot line, great pass. Sneaks it through. There's a swing from Argentina. I mean, they're a team known for tipping and rolling and carving and recycling and replaying and it's so crazy to play against and to watch and it's so impressive. But down 17, 22, I think you gotta go for the swing, go for the hit, just like he did just then. Ramos. Nice pass, I cannot get enough of that pass. Great rundown. Let's go, oh. Brazil is blocking so many balls. I don't remember them block, I mean, they block a lot of balls, let's be honest here, Eric. This play, Lucarelli with the dime. Allen, a little bit out of rhythm there. Great rundown, I wanna watch that one again. So Palacio starts there, runs us down to the corner, great ball, great ball control too. Tip, ah, ah, weird covers, and then so that's a really hard play, you guys, these weird covers, but if you can, when you're covering, get the ball high. Give your team a chance to run an offense. Give them a chance to get a swing, a set, anything. If it's bang, bang like that, error, high. Okay, match point, one, 24-17 Brazil. Puts it in play. They're serving Danani quite often, and it's not working out for them. What happened here? Great ball, back set to Lima, one-on-one. -on -one. Someone hit the net. 18-24, Lima, he's gotta go for it. Yep. Misses it long. Brazil gets their semi-revenge on Argentina and wins the 2021 South American Continental Championships. Congrats to them. All right, guys, what a match. Brazil wins the South American Championship after losing to Argentina in the bronze medal match from Tokyo. So maybe a little bit of revenge, but I do think Brazil would probably take the bronze medal over that match. But entertaining match all around. I think the biggest difference was Brazil's block. They were touching the ball so many times and blocking so many balls. That was crazy to watch. They definitely have that size advantage over Argentina and they took advantage of it 100% in that match. Anyway guys, I hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope you learned a little bit. I know that I did. I also hope that you keep following along on my journey and our team's journey, Zox's journey in the Plus Liga this season. We are currently 5-0 and play again on Saturday, so wish us luck. But as always, get out, play some volleyball if you can, have some fun, and I'll see you all soon. Peace.